So your neurotypical wife is wired in her own particular way, specifically for nurturing, for love, for connection. And uh, she is also by nature, given that she has uh, hard wiring in her to potentially be a mother someday, and possibly she currently is a mother, she can also be highly protective of her loved ones. And so when she is in this case with a husband on the autism spectrum who mostly unintentionally is emotionally unavailable, then this disconnection fires a danger pathway. In other words, in her brain, there is a mechanism that alerts her that there is something to fear. In this case, fear of abandonment, rejection, disconnection. And so some of the behaviors that you witness in your NT wife are the result of fear, fear of this disconnect. And how that looks is oftentimes anger. So when she is angry, lecturing, arguing, even threatening, when she is parental, when she is agitated with some of the things that you say and do, or maybe she's upset with some things you're supposed to be doing or saying and you don't, all of that to you looks like uh, nagging and a source of stress and you want to separate from that. And you do in the version of a shutdown or meltdown, which in the end is just more disconnection, which then reinforces her fear of abandonment, which then reinforces her need to connect, to reconnect. It's not an exaggeration to say that if she has experienced years and years of what she would call emotional deprivation, there is this low-grade chronic fight-or-flight response operating at all times. So now she has this steady drip, drip, drip of adrenaline, noradrenaline, cortisol, cortisone, and all of these other fight-or-flight chemicals, which basically results in chronic anxiety and it again it operates at such a low level that it may not even be noticeable in her and could be operating at a very subconscious level but unfortunately with years and years of being in this situation where the danger pathway is being fired in her brain and she's she's getting these little tinges of alert and alarms going off that something is wrong it begins to manifest in physical symptoms. So after a while, the emotional pain will result in physical pain. So if your NT wife is experiencing some physical ailments currently, most notably autoimmune disease, then it's a pretty good indication that she has some emotional turmoil playing in the background chronically. So on those occasions when she appears to be verbally attacking you, she's being verbal, no doubt. It's not necessarily an attack against you, but when it appears that way, know that her danger neural pathway that operates in her brain is firing at its loudest. So perhaps you can muster up a little bit of compassion and understanding for your NT wife and realize that her complaining behavior and her anger is not something against you per se. It's her way to deal with this fear of abandonment and disconnection lack of love, lack of intimacy, lack of emotional reciprocity. It is literally a defense mechanism that manifests as a result of the danger pathway being ignited. To put it a different way, she feels unsafe, she feels vulnerable and exposed, and these behaviors that you witness that are undesirable to you are her best attempt to regain security, intimacy, emotional reciprocity, love, connection and bonding.